Hi guys, welcome to the video. Alright, today's video I'm going to show you guys how to fast travel in Burnout Paradise. Alright, so pretty much you go up to any uh, race, you know, and then start it. This is only for single player, you can't do it multiplayer. I don't think so. But, this actually will save your time. Don't do the same mistake that I did, you know, I didn't, I didn't know about this until I figured it out later. So, pretty much I'm going to start this race, right? And then I'm going to finish it. Happens. So pretty much you do the race, and then if you beat it, There's going to be an option where you can like restart the race. But, since you completed it already, and say you need to go back there to finish another race, well you press the right arrow, and then press right arrow again, and then go down to restart last event, and then restart it, and then it will spawn you back all the way back there where you just started. So then once this happens, just stand still, let the cars go, and it will stop, and then you're right here. So if you need to complete like any race or challenges around here, this can help you. So let's say, you know, there's like two races right here, you guys see in the map. Okay, so let me go to this race right here right now. <clears throat> so I can show you guys. Go here, right? I'm not gonna do it, but I'm just showing you like example. So I zoom out, I view the race, it's all the way over there at the finish line. So if I finished it, I can restart it and it'll push me back to the finish, I mean not the finish line, the starting line and then I'll be right there and then I can do the other race that's next to it. So this is pretty much how you can like fast travel in Burnout Paradise. I hope this helps you guys out and it should, it's, it should save you more time because I had to play for like 12 hours so this can maybe, maybe save you 6 hours, 3 hours, 4 hours less. Which is good. Alright, thank you guys for watching. And peace out. Bye guys, I love you.